Hi there. Do you want to learn about the talented Studebaker brothers who were inventors of a wagon company? And they had a very interesting life. The brothers were born in Pennsylvania and moved to South Bend, Indiana, which is where they grew up and is where the Clement the was born on March 12, 1831, and he did not go to college. Jacob F. Studebaker was born on May 26, 1844, and he went to college for two terms. Henry Studebaker was born on January 5, 1826, and he did not go to college. John M. Studebaker was born on October 10, 1833, and he did not go to college. Studebaker was born in April in 1836, and he did not go to college. Clement married the wonderful Charity Brent on October 12, 1852. Clement and Hall had two children, but sadly they died, and so did Charity in 1860. Clement got remarried to Anna Hart Milburn, and they had three children. accomplishments that the Studebakers had is that they invented a type, of, a type of wagon. Another accomplishment that the Studebaker brothers had is that they had their own company called the Studebaker Brothers Manufacturing Company. Another accomplishment that the Studebaker brothers had is that they co-founded Studebaker Corporation. The Studebaker brothers faced many challenges, and here are some of them. One of the challenges is that Clement's family died, and that distracted him from building wagons. Another one of the challenges is that one of the brothers wanted to be a wagon maker but the parents didn't want them to. Instead, they wanted him to be a farmer. We remember the Studebaker brothers because they are very talented men. They helped our community out by making a source of transportation. And they are also very creative human beings. The Studebaker brothers are very interesting. We are proud of them because they made a type of wagon and because they are very interesting to learn about. Some interesting facts about them is that they, Clement Studebaker, was the leader of the company. And because the brothers could make two wagons a month in 24 a year. But as time went on, they could make way more wagons. In the first year of business, the brothers made about somewhere around three wagons and they sold two wagons. Sadly, Clement Studebaker died on November 27, 1901 in South Indiana from natural causes he had. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned about the Studebaker Brothers. Bye.